A tabun oven, or simply tabun, also transliterated tabun, from the Arabic, tabon is a clay oven, shaped like a truncated cone, with an opening at the bottom from which to stoke the fire. Built and used in biblical times as the family, neighborhood, or village oven, tabun ovens continue to be built and used in parts of the Middle East today. Nowadays, some of the tabun ovens are also made out of metal. Usage. The tabun oven has historically been used to bake flatbreads such as tabun bread and lafa, and has been in widespread use among Arab and Jewish ethnic communities in the Greater Middle East for centuries. <inaudible> fuel Many types of fuel or a combination of fuels can be used to heat a tabun. Dried animal dung, dried bird droppings, chopped and dried tree branches or tree trimmings, wood chips, charcoal, dried tree leaves, fabrics, and other materials are potential fuels. <inaudible> Firing The top opening is covered and a layer of fuel is spread on the outside of the shell and lid. Once the fire takes hold, the fuel is covered with a layer of ash. The fuel will smolder for hours, usually all night long. The smoke also helps in repelling insects and mosquitoes. In the process the heat gets stored in the foundation. The amount of fuel varies depending on the size of oven. <laughs> Baking When the smoke stops, the lid is removed and chunks of dough are hand flattened and placed directly on the limestones. In most ovens, four to five loaves can be baked at the same time. Then the opening is sealed and the fire stoked using the hot embers and ashes. When the bread is ready, the lid is removed and the bread taken out. The process can be repeated, or other dishes can be baked using metal or pottery trays. The bottom of the bread will take the shape of the pebbles or other materials used in constructing the oven floor. This baking process is unique and economical and produces aromatic and flavorful food. Construction Shell Made of yellow pottery clay soil. The best is from Arub or Al Arub. The soil is wetted and made into a thick clay mixed with chopped wheat stem hay. The clay is hand formed to make the dome shaped shell. It is about 30 to 40 in diameter at its base, about 15 to 20 inches, h with an open top, approximately 15. In diameter, the shell wall is about 1 to 2 inches thick. The shell is sun-baked for weeks. <inaudible> <inaudible> Foundation About 4 to 5 feet in diameter and about 15 to 20 inches in depth. Usually filled with compacted locally abundant materials known to handle and store heat, broken glass, sand, rock salt, suwan stones very hard compact volcanic stones. <inaudible> Lid Made of clay or a sheet metal piece large enough to cover the top opening. Process In a sheltered area, usually a clay hut or a cave, the foundation is dug in the ground filled and compacted. The shell is placed, wider side down, on top. A layer of clean smooth limestone pebbles about one inch in diameter is spread on top of foundation inside the shell to form a clean baking surface. See also Taboon bread Tandoor List of cooking appliances <laughs>